Hello. Uh, this is Sajid, and you're watching my YouTube channel. Mm, this uh, is another video uh, on Python uh, language. So, uh, in today's video, we will look at uh, data types like uh, how many and which data types are there. So we will have, a, I mean, uh, some high level look on them and uh, we will have more detailed information uh, about them as we move forward. We, we, can, we will have, uh, you can say, um, some different videos on different uh, data types like list, tuple, dictionary like this. We will have detailed videos later. So in programming, the data type is an important concept, you know. Variables, as you know, we uh, had a video on this before. So variables can uh, store uh, variables can store data of different types, and different types can do different things. Yeah. So in Python, we have uh, different types, and we can categorize them. Like text, as you know, the text can be uh, stored in a data type called string and numeric types like numbers are integer float and complex sequence type list tuple range sequence means like sequence of numbers or text or mix or objects right mapping type is dictionary set types you know set and frozen set set you may know from mathematics Boolean type, Boolean binary types like bytes, byte array, a memory view, non type, non type. Yeah. So keep remember these uh, type of data, uh, these like categories and uh, what are there, like different data types in these categories. So as we move forward in our course, uh, we will be having detailed looks uh, on these things. So for as of now, we just look at uh, them on high level. So getting the data type uh, in uh, as this method we have uh, discussed before, type uh, method uh, or function uh, gives us a type of data type in a variable. For example, here we have uh, this variable x is equal to five, and then type is telling us this is an integer type of. Okay. So next is uh, uh, setting the data types. Yeah. Okay. As you know. Uh, okay. In Python variables, uh, uh, there is no uh, specific command to create variables. They are created when we assign some uh, value to them. So here, you know, when x is equal to hello world, so data type is string, you know. So if we look inside, uh, here when we are checking type of this x, it shows class is string. So similarly, uh, we are looking at uh, ways, like how to define different uh, data types in Python. Like when we have to define an integer, we define x is equal to 20 when we have to float x is equal to 20.5 and when we have complex as you know complex numbers uh, from uh, mathematics that x is equal to 1j these are complex numbers then we have list where x is equal to apple banana cherry as list as you know is a collection of uh, elements which can be like text or numbers or like that so then we have to uh, tuple x is equal to apple banana cherry this is another collection and then range x is uh, fix and uh, look at this it's creating when we say range 6 and we print it gives range 0 to 6 class uh, range when we are looking at type of uh, type of x 
then we have this dictionary these are uh, sort of uh, uh, key value pairs and name and John age 36 then we have set you know mathematically uh, this is how we define them in curly uh, braces we have apple banana cherry these are elements frozen set uh, again is a set uh, whose values cannot change like it's frozen uh, we cannot change them boolean is you know is true or false then we have bytes when we define bytes we uh, put this letter or character b before this string so this is a way to define data type bytes then byte array memory view okay and x is equal to none none type so this is how different uh, data types are uh, defined and uh, we will have more detailed looks on them uh, later but the most common of common uh, of these are like strings integers and floats and uh, uh, booleans and uh, uh, right and none i mean these these are some of very uh, common then we will have special things like list or ta uh, tuple or range dictionary sets etc so as we move forward in our tutorial we will be having a detailed look on them next look at this setting uh, the specific data type so uh, as you know before we just directly assigned uh, you can say uh, values to a variable here we are specifically doing it um, uh, sp specifically uh, if you want to specify data type you can use the following you know uh, constructor type so x is equal to string hello world and uh, x is equal to int and uh, x is equal to float i mean you can mention the type of data uh, you are storing in these uh, variables right so i will uh, wrap up my video here uh, the purpose of this year video was to just to make you familiar with these uh, data types and categories and uh, uh, please uh, if possible memorize these things the, you will have to use them again and again and these will be quite useful for later use so um, if video was uh, useful for you please do share it uh, with other friends and colleagues and uh, subscribe to my channel uh, uh, for now I will uh, 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 close here today's session and i'll be back soon with another video by that time take care allah hafiz and bye for now